Hello, this is Hadi Lisha, Interventional Cardiovascular Specialist, going over another sterile technique to maintain the perclose suture sterile while the patient has an indwelling large bore sheath um, um, getting out of the cath lab to the CCU or ICU. This is the sheath side port uh, technique, the cut sheath side port technique. Any sheath would be cut in a way that's relatively shorter than a uh, needle introducer. Um, and basically what is going to happen is that large, ultimately that sheath side port is going to be housing those sutures in it. And then the non-locking suture will be locked in place in order to maintain tension on the suture itself while um, and minimize the, uh, the oozing around the arteriotomy. So, you're gonna... so the first part of this technique is to obviously open up uh, the sheath side port stopcock in an open position like you see in here and you have the needle introducer and basically the non-locking suture is pulled first um, and this does not have to be introduced all the way a couple of centimeters into the needle introducer and usually this will be pulled out this way and you can see that suture coming out from the other side same thing. now we're going to do the same thing with the locking suture we'll introduce the introducer through the sheath side port and then we're going to take the tip of the locking suture carefully without pulling too much on it in order to make sure we don't lock the knot uh, we advance it a couple of centimeters in and usually the introducer can pull it through. Most of the time it barely reaches the side port, but both of them are out of the side port at this point. So the whole purpose of the technique is to have not only those sutures housed in a sterile fashion, but also this will allow you to pull on the non-locking suture up and while there's tension, you're going to be locking the side port in this direction and this will allow the sutures to be locked in place and that tension, the back tension on the arteriotomy site to be maintained. At this point, um, obviously the sutures are exiting the side port. We're going to have to cover those to maintain sterility. At this point, in order to cover the outside portion of the suture hanging out of the side port we're going to be taking a three or five cc syringe we'll remove the plunger and basically thread that suture inside the syringe we're gonna lock it on the lower lock and we're gonna place the plunger in and now you have a closed system where you have the sheath um, and this, those perclose sutures are laying inside the tubing of the side port of the sheath and the syringe is covering the outside portion and this can be laid to the side and covered with an adhesive dressing. Uh, it plays the role of both pulling the non-locking suture up and cinching the arteriotomy site to minimize sheath oozing.